Hello everyone. Mulesoft Certified Developer Level 2 exam, which was quite long awaited, is finally live. And as a part of this video, we are going to discuss everything that you need to know about this exam. So before we proceed, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, then I request you to do it immediately. And if you are planning for MCD Level 1, MCI or MCPA, certification exam then do check the description section for the amazing uh, coupons for udemy practice test so let's move ahead and see what the certification is all about level 2 is very much different than the level 1 exam level 1 exam was more focused on introducing any point platform its components introducing you to connectors any point exchange and then deploying your applications on the cloud hub whereas level 2 is the next step step to it it validates if you can work independently on the production mule applications. Next, it is aligned to the DevOps way of working. I mean, as you know, throughout the IT industry, the focus is on moving towards the DevOps way. So this certification definitely aligns with that roadmap. And finally, it deals with the non-functional requirements. So as a part of level one, non-functional requirements were never discussed. So those are being focused in the level two uh, examination. In the later slide, I have uh, already discussed the details of the, the certification exam. Let's discuss some of the common questions that can come across your mind. First is, is it substitute for MCD level one? Answer is no. Rather, it is a next step to MCD level one, as I explained in the previous slide. But this exam is more from the DevOps perspective as against to the MCD level one, which was only from the dev perspective. In, in fact, MCD level one certification is the only prerequisite for this MCD level two exam. Next is, is it free the way MCD level one is? Again, sir, is again, no. You have to purchase $250 voucher if you want to appear for this exam. And there is no self-paced course available at this point of time in MuleSoft training portal. There are two courses available but those are the paid courses for which you need to buy the voucher from MuleSoft training portal. Let's discuss what are the prerequisites of this uh, exam. So as I mentioned, the only prerequisites are you should be having your MuleSoft certified developer level one uh, certification and it should be the current certification, which means it should be still valid. So as you know, MCD certification is valid for two years. So when you apply for MCD level two exam, your MCD level one should be still valid in order to appear for level two exam. Let's discuss what is the format of exam. So format is same like that of the MCD level one. It will have 60 questions, 120 minutes and 70% is the passing. And you will again, uh, the way it was in level one exam, you have multiple choice question. It's a closed book exam and proctored, which you can give from your uh, home or from your office. Again, the supported language is English. And as it was the case with level one, here also you have three, uh, five max attempts uh, available for your particular user, which you are using to log into training portal. Now, the next thing that we are going to discuss is about the MuleSoft trainings. So as I mentioned, there are two trainings which are provided by MuleSoft for this certification. It definitely puzzles me that why MuleSoft did not create a single training course instead of creating the two different training courses. But yeah, that is how it is. So first training course is any point platform development, production ready development practices. This is again a three day course. And on the similar line, we have second course, which is any point platform development, production ready integrations. So as I have clearly mentioned, you need to attend both the courses. That's why I have explicitly highlighted and over there. So it is not that you can attend either of the training in order to be to become eligible to attend that exam. That's not the case. You need to attend both the training courses. Then only you will get the voucher, which will allow you to appear for the exam. Now, are there any free resources available? So there is one practice exam which is available on the MuleSoft training portal and that practice exam is on the similar lines as, uh, as the real exam is. It will have the 60 questions, 120 minutes uh, 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 timer is available. So you can get a feel of how the actual questions are gonna be like. And apart from that, 
there are data sheets and other information provided on the mules of training portal the links of uh, those data sheets and uh, uh, other documents which are available on training portal i have added in the description section you can go through it now what are the key skills which are uh, which are uh, which are validated as a part of this exam again as i mentioned maintaining the production ready anypoint platform uh, apis then implementing maintainable and modular mule applications and their maven build maven build is again one aspect which we never discussed in uh, level 1 exam then implement monitorable mule applications securing data in rest and in transit and finally implementing performant and reliable mule applications so these are the key skills which are going to get validated as a part of level 2 exam so this was a quick summary about mcd level 2 exam if you find this video useful then do click the like button and if you have any suggestions or if you know any further information about this certification which is not captured in my video please feel free to add it in the comment section thank you and happy learning